DIY as we know it first arrived in the UK in the 1950s as Brits sought to brighten up their homes and bring an end to post-war gloom. Since then, people have flocked to one stop for all their home improvement needs. Nationwide has looked into decor trends over the years and what Brits like to do to add colour and value to their homes. Having worked in home improvements for the past 30 years, I'm a huge advocate of DIY. Across the last 60 years, men and women have attempted to put up shelves, wallpaper, paint, lay floors and even fit kitchens to save money. But what has changed over the years is the interior decor that people have chosen and have there been some unforgettable moments. During the 1950s, interiors were inspired by US American diners. Everything US, in fact, was very much on trend. The 1960s was an interesting decade, the era of free love. Paisley and pop art were very, very prevalent, and it was also the decade of the fitted kitchen. Autumnal, earthy colours reigned supreme in the 1970s. Patterns were really strong, and no home was complete without a shagpile rug and a lava lamp. Tartan was very much the go-to pattern for on-trend designs, as were wood chip wallpaper and Pampers and Avocado bathroom suites. I started my career in the 1980s and my goodness, what a decade to be starting out in interior design. Everything had frills attached to it, inspired by Lady Diana's blouses at the time. If I had anything that stopped or didn't move, had a frill, contrast piping and more frills and bows added to it. Horrific. The 90s was a decade of stencils, rag rolled walls, everything was very overly ornate. The noughties was all about minimalism and concrete was the material of choice. Towards the end of the decade, the feature wall became king and strong colours were introduced once again. There has been a return to comfort this decade and current interior trends are all about easy, practical and sociable family living. The industrial style and Scandinavian living are key and will continue to dominate interiors for a few years to come. 